Hello, this is Tanner Tech, and today I'm going to show you how to build an oscilloscope. So I found this old CRT at a garage sale for about two bucks, and I figured I'd make it an oscilloscope. So I took off the TV's plastic cover so I could see the electronics. I did this so that way I could be able to solder the wires that I needed, and to be able and it just looks a lot cooler without the cover. Now you need to be careful when opening up the TV because there's tons of capacitors inside here and also make sure you don't really touch any of the circuits while the TV is on because of this flyback transformer. So all I really needed to convert this CRT into an oscilloscope is these four wires and joints. So these two prongs go to the vertical deflection coil and these two prongs go to the horizontal deflection coil so I took these two wires that were originally soldered to the vertical deflection coil and I moved them to the horizontal deflection coil and I took the wires that would go to the horizontal deflection coil and I'm not using them and then I soldered these two of my wires to the vertical deflection coil so that way it can go to whatever I'm testing so I'm going to turn it on using this switch, which just obviously came with the TV. So once it's on, you can hook up these two wires to anything you want to test, and it'll show up on the screen. Right now, I can only um, look at voltages that are under 1 volt, because otherwise this would happen. It just goes off the screen. I haven't been able to build a conversion circuit that will let me use any voltage with this, but I will do that eventually. One thing you can use this for is audio. If you wire up a headphone jack to this system, then you can display the music you're playing. You can also see the pulses uh, Arduino puts out for a servo. If you connect the signal pin, to one lead and the ground pin to another lead. You can see the pulses the Arduino gives out for the servo right here. Thank you for watching.